Okay. Hey everyone, welcome back to Navigating Credit Union Broadcast Center. Uh, this is Dave Sean Young. He is with the Lion King, among many other fantastic <laughs> things on your resume. I'm going over this. I'm like, wow. So you're playing Simba yes. in the Lion King over at PPAC. Yes. So the Lion King, Disney's The Lion King is here until March 19th. Mm -hmm. um, so going over your resume, my goodness. So you were on Broadway <laughs> with the Lion King. You're here yes. on the national tour. Yes. Uh, some of the other things you've done, Carol King, the musical, Motown, which was phenomenal, uh, Hairspray, Hunchback of Notre Dame, Sister Act, um, Hello Dolly, uh, and a few other things. So I just want to give you all the, uh, all the credit lucky. that you deserve. Oh, thank you, thank you. So, uh, wow, The Lion King yes. was fortunate enough to, to see it. What is it like to be part of a show of this magnitude? Oh gosh, it's amazing. I mean, it's so nice to be a part of a show that you say the name and people already have these expectations of like what to expect. They, it's part of their childhood, it's part of their children's childhood. It's, it's special to them, it means something to them. So it's a lot of uh, responsibility, but it's so awesome to be able to say, I play Simba the Lion King, and people have an idea exactly what that is. You don't have to explain anything. They already know. <laughs> so true. Yes. So true. And so, uh, you know, I, I, I saw it, and I was, uh, I was moved. I was, hey, I, I had tears. I cried. Yes. I was one of those people that yes. I literally, I cried. I it's, cried last night too. Uh, so. yeah, really? yes. I hope for a good reason. Yes, yes, yes. A good reason. Yes. Um, it's really one of those things I think that really people should see, especially if kids want to be involved in musical theater or just to be exposed to the arts. Absolutely. Uh, do you think something like this is important or just to have kids be exposed to musical theater or to arts in general? Absolutely. Um, I mean, for myself, if I wasn't exposed to the arts at a young age, this, I don't know what I'd be doing right now, but it would not be this, yeah. but it, it kind of changed my life. I remember sitting in the theater for the first time in the seventh grade, uh, watching a production of Ragtime before it went to Broadway. And it, it blew my mind. I had never seen anything like that. I didn't even really know that you could produce something like that live on stage. And so I ran home and told my mom immediately, like, I want to be in lessons. I want, this is what I want to do. It, it, it completely changed everything I thought about. So I think it's very important. Uh, yes. And so some of the costume, I do have a cheat sheet here. Sorry, Josh, I do have paper. I mean, just the costumes are... The costumes are gorgeous. I don't know how people even thought They're gorgeous. To do this. And even the puppetry, the way that they the make the animals actually come to life is phenomenal. It's amazing. They're so lifelike. They're, it's so, it's, it's magical. There are, so this, so this is what I was going to grab the paper for. There are 25 kinds of animals, birds, yes. fish, and insects represented. It took 17,000 hours just to build the puppets and masks. It's amazing. It's absolutely beautiful. What's it like just being around that? It's pretty cool. Uh, I mean, I find myself sometimes when I'm on top of the rock at the end looking down at all the animals, and it's it's mind-blowing. You, you kind of lose track and forget that you're looking at people inside of a costume and you actually see an animal. I mean, the giraffes, they actually look like a giraffe they, on stage. You saw it. It's, it's, it's mind-blowing. It, it is it really mind-blowing and it's, it's beautiful and it's, I mean, it's a work of genius by the creators of the show and how they decided to bring it to light, so. What's your favorite part of the show? My favorite part of the show, that I do or period? Let's do, ask uh, both. Okay. Both. <laughs> uh, my favorite part of the show is Circle of Life. I feel like you can't beat Circle of Life. It's, um, I've been a part of the show for many years off and on, and it still gives me chills every time I watch it. It's, it just is what it is, so I feel like you can't, you can't beat Circle of Life. My favorite part to do is um, He Lives in You, when Simba kind of decides to take his place as king and, and step into the man that he's supposed to be, and he has this whole change of heart, and he does this dance and sings this song, and it's a big celebration. That's my favorite moment to perform. What's it like to see... Uh, people transform and for you to transform into these characters. Yeah, uh, into the characters as a whole. Yeah, I mean it takes hours, so one, just the process of it, it. Does. and it's two, pretty special. what's it like to see that? I mean it's so many layers to it, I mean first you just start with just coming into the theater and sitting down with the makeup artist and getting into makeup and costume and that adds a whole nother layer of what you're bringing on the stage and then you're stretching, you're warming up and, and it is kind of it's kind of special. You see these people outside of the show as like friends and they're so different than the people that you're encountering on stage. It's kind of amazing, but that's why they're professionals. So that's why they do what they do, hopefully. Do you like the acting or the singing better? 
is it you love it all? Uh, I mean, it's kind of a silly question. I but. love it all. <laughs> to be honest, uh, so my, my training is more so in acting first. Mm -hmm. um, and I feel much more comfortable singing when I get to tell a story and throw myself into a role rather than standing with a microphone and singing. I'd probably say acting. Dave. Yeah, and that's what. So I'm, I might seem silly because you're in musical theater, yeah, yeah, yeah. but uh, you know some people are feel more strongly about the singing no, of environment. Course, of course, of course. Um, and so what's next for you? You're here until March 19th. We're and here then until March 19th. What are you doing next? And, well, we're still on tour, so yeah. we go off to Salt Lake City, Utah, and then after that, I think maybe St. Louis, and we're just traveling around the country and. Bringing this story to you guys. <laughs> Have you had a chance to explore Providence at all? Or are you? I haven't too much yet because we just got here and immediately set up and started and open. We had an opening party last night, yeah. um, but I've been here before with other shows, um, and I love Providence. So I'm excited to get out and explore and have some food, have some drinks, and meet some locals. And yeah, good. Well, we hope you have an enjoyable time Thank here. You and so I know much. I have to let you go. I, I actually could talk to you and talk about the show <laughs> for all day, I but I know it. you have to go get ready. <laughs> That's okay. Yes. Yes. Uh, all right. So day from Zumba from the Lion King if you have a chance PPAC is running the show through March 19th so if you're interested in getting tickets uh, I would encourage people to go if they have yes. the opportunity it really is oh, what's your favorite animal from from the show my favorite animal from the show it would be the cheetah the cheetah, cheetah. Amazing. It's pretty amazing, I, right? I the mean, way it's, <laughs> it's it's and, and mind how do you, does it does it change the more you're involved in it, the more you're like, you're like oh, I like the elephant, oh, the wildebeest. Yes, I oh, think when the, I first started, it was the giraffe. Now the it's the cheetah. The giraffe, <laughs> and then you're like the cheetah. Then you're we'll kind see of, what it is in a few weeks. And then the puppets. <laughs> it's really hard, and it's really just spectacular how it these is. people pull it off. They look, they all look amazing, and they're all so fantastic at convincing you that they are what they are so if you could be uh, oh, one more question mm -hmm. if, and then you really do have to yeah, go please. I know you do have to please go I'm going to get in trouble oh if you could be one other act in the show who Ooh. do you think you would be I would choose. I would love to play Scar I'm never cast as the bad guy I'm always the good guy <laughs> yeah. so I would love to get the opportunity to um transform into an evil sort of character Ooh, you know, and, yeah. and play that side of things for a little bit so Just I'd say Scar try something different yeah why not and then, and then go back to being. And then be again. Simba again. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Do something. Thank you so much. Here, let's take a picture. Yes, absolutely, absolutely. And then you have to go get ready. Yes.